Very overwhelmed would be the strongest word I think right now. It's just, I didn't really think it would happen for a long time. Seeing the struggle that we went through was sort of one of those things where you just had to like keep pushing through it. Um, to see it actually up there was unreal. It's still hard to believe that it actually like happened and it came true. It's been 401 days since Nick Hotchkiss's first delegation at the Catholic District School Board to fly the pride flag at Catholic schools across the region during the month of June. After a long struggle, this morning they proudly raised the flag at St. Ignatius of Loyola in Oakville. This is the, the first year that the pride flag has been raised uh, in Halton, in Halton Catholic. Um, it's historic in that the, the first time that Nick delegated, the, the, the motion was defeated. Um, and so when they delegated again, um, you know, trustees voted in support. Um, it's historic in the work that we've been doing as a board to provide training and resources and supports to our students. Um, it's historic in terms of now we're able to have visible symbols outside of our school not just on the inside of our school to show our community uh, that we support our 2SLGBTQIA students. Um, it would be dishonest of me though not to acknowledge that while a lot of people were trying to start this fire, a lot of people were also trying to put it out, um, which was a bit of a struggle, but we ended up getting there eventually. Um, while we did say no at the beginning, the fire that we started here spread to other boards across Ontario and Canada and started a larger conversation about the importance of creating safe spaces for queer people and Catholic spaces. And those boards that did say yes and did fly the pride flag last year revealed the true importance that flying the flag can have not only on current students, but those who have already left the halls of their schools. Hopefully it shows them that Catholic spaces can be safe spaces for queer people. There's always been that sort of complicated relationship um, between Catholicism and queerness and I think that having this flag up here openly for every student to see, it shows that we're not afraid to visibly support our students and we're not afraid to say that we know you're here and we do love you for every single part of who you are. It, it was just a, a celebration of, of everything that Loyola is about. Our school motto is dignity, equity and respect and we need to make sure that we're living that. It's not just on our wall but we're, you know, living that in, in everything that we do. It's crazy seeing how many people this has reached. This started as a little project that I had in my senior year, like I said, and to see it spread this far to this many other boards, to see the amount of people that have come up to me today and thanked me, and I've never met these people, to see the reach that this has had is just absolutely phenomenal, and it really touches my heart to see that hard work does pay off. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.